Hi guys, it's the start of week three of my 12 week transformation. As you know, I'm following Neil Hill's Yoda 3 training principle right now. So week three is the total annihilation phase, as he likes to call it. Um, I can reassure you that it certainly is the case. Um, so the repetition range has gone higher this week. Uh, for smaller body parts like your arms, anywhere between 15 to 20, uh, maybe 17, 22, something like that. Um, there's a lot of drop sets and things like that. I maximise the blood flow and hit the slow twitch muscle fibres as well. Um, so today you saw me train arms. Um, the first exercise we went into was uh, alternating dumbbell curls. I uh, did three sets of that and it was absolute killer. Uh, the first set I did 20 reps. Those were 20 kilo dumbbells. So that's really heavy for me. Um, the Millennium Sport Technology Cryo 2 I'm using at the minute has definitely done my strength of the world of good. Um, before this transformation, I'd have got maybe 12 reps of those weights, so I've seen a huge difference as I have with a, a PhD VMAX pump, which I highly rate. Um, so that's the first exercise. We did three sets of that. Um, you saw me do 20 reps in that one set, and then uh, two sets following, it was about 18 and 19 reps. So obviously you're not going to be able to get the same amount of reps as you did on the first set. If you can, then obviously you won't push yourself hard enough. exercise you see me do guys was uh, barbell curls on the cable machine by now you know I like to do close grips simply because it hits the after heads my biceps uh, found over the years that's really helped develop my arms my arms are one of my stronger body parts and I'd say that has a lot to do with it um, the other thing is that I've always used a full range of motion which I feel has really helped my arms grow and they continue to grow uh, because I get out of my head the weight I'm using instead I go for full range of motion so uh, the muscles are under tension through the whole repetition. Um, we use repetition range of 15 to 20 uh, on that exercise. Uh, three sets again, and that is absolutely killer. Because again, we're doing the full stack, guys. So just because we're doing high reps, you must understand we're not doing light weight. We're still going as heavy as we can, which is why it's so brutal. If you'd say do 20 reps, that's no problem. If you, you know, halve the weight you'd normally use. But we were going all out to go really heavy and uh, that makes the training really intense and it you know it really does make you dig deep and you have to really get head into it otherwise you won't finish the set <laughs>
the biceps off. I went into uh, reverse grip curls. Uh, I don't use them as very often. Obviously, it's known to hit your forearms, but I do feel it hits your biceps as well. That's just a nice um, exercise to thicken your arms, you know, forearms as well. I've never trained my, trained my forearms ever because uh, I feel I get a good workout just with uh, general work training. But um, I like to do reverse curls very occasionally just because I think they add to the overall th uh, thickness of your arms. So again, we're doing higher reps of 15 to 20, three sets of that. And then that was biceps complete.